number of local oak here that I, I had growing in my back garden for the last two years or so. They're just getting too big. They needed to be taken out this year. So uh, planting them locally down on the uh, on the ridge, just adjacent to uh, Castle Park Village uh, Estate, and uh, that's it really. So they joined their harvested local acorns. So how do you uh, go about uh, planting an oak tree, John? Uh, you just make a nice, a nice, uh, nice generous hole. You get a nice little pick your spot. Clear the ground a little bit, not too much. And dig a nice, like a nice square to, to allow the plant to root ball to space. And dig down, gauge the, uh, the length of the root you're working with. So accommodate that and soften up the soil underneath so that the root can, can the, the oak throws down quite a tap root, straight down. So you want, you want it to be able to do that. So the hole may be a sort of square for those, they don't have a big root system, does it? So what you want to do is allow that, that tap root to get, to get can, you, can you show us the root of the oak, John? Oh, now there, there for instance, is one. Dug that up from the garden, yes, so you can see the... Let's have a look. It's even begin to dry already. So really you want a hole at right. least that that deep there from, from finger to finger, that sort of depth to allow the the, uh, the the tap root rather than squashing it up. You don't want to be crushing up, you want to have it like that in the ground. Right. And then a, a bit of space around it so that it can grow out to find root hairs, as you can see are already doing that. Right. So the root hairs are what John? Oh these little finer finer roots coming out on the side. And okay. this is their main tap root then. Right, right, right. You know, it's all going on down under underground, especially during the winter. Yeah. Okay. okay. We'll just take a look. So you can dig it out. It's good earth, is it? Good, very good. A load of soil here. They love that. Yeah. Good and soft. Plenty of moisture. No fear of it. So then you just you sort of gauge it. Yeah, it's perfect. See? You're not. You're not. You're not. Uh, okay. You're not bundling the root up. So firm it back in. Not too firm, no. You don't want to. The soil is compact enough as it is. You do want to anchor. You do want to anchor the tree so it doesn't move too much in the wind, especially when you hear there's a windy week coming up. Which uh, Evelyn Cusack has informed us this morning. You know, have to wait on all to you one. Right. So then I might. What I might do here now is. Got a little saw here. Cut it out. It is all about the shot, John. The shot is the main. I'll firm it in, not too much. Little tug, and she's she's anchored. That's or it. Why are the leaves still on it at this time of the year? Ah, oh, well, the oak, the oak will hold on to its leaves into November. Um, Especially when it's younger. Yeah, and it hasn't been. We haven't had any severe frosts yet. It's been a cool autumn, but it certainly hasn't been a cold one. Yeah. Although not last night was a significant frost. Probably more than minus three or minus four. Believe it that, that's not that bad. So we're living in Canada, so we'll know how that one, eh? I'm going to put another one here now. That's too close. That's too close, yeah, it is. I'll go over here. I don't want to go too far over here. Right. 